Okay, so this is going to be an unboxing video for an Explore Scientific 102mm refractor. It's an achromatic. I, uh, let's get into it. So I bought this off of High Point Scientific. Um, actually kind of an ordeal trying to get it just because I did buy this around the holidays and there was a big, it's kind of difficult to make sure that I was able to be the last one to get it on the shipment that they had. And they were able to get it out to me before the holidays, which is awesome, even though I wasn't really buying it for anyone in particular, I was buying it for myself. So, let's get this. Packing information off. And this is a 4 inch refractor, an Acromat. Got it on sale for a pretty good price. It was their Black Friday sale that they had extended pretty much through Christmas. Alright. So you open it up, and the first thing you got is all your accessories. So here is the 2 inch. Diagonal, enhanced 99% reflectivity. It's uh, it's actually pretty high quality. I'm pretty impressed with their um, their factory, their stock stuff that comes out with it. Here is their 50 millimeter. I lost a couple of the mounting screws. Um, kind of come flying out of the bag. Anyway, uh, this is their 50. Oh gosh, what is this? Yeah, 50 millimeter finer scope. Yeah, I'll find it later. All right, anyway, uh, since this is an Acromat, I did decide to buy a filter. This is a Badar uh, 495 long pass yellow filter. So this should help to ease some of the um, chromatic aberration that you're gonna find kinda in every Acromat. Alright, that's it. And then we get to the main scope itself. All right, it's packaged in here with a couple styrofoam blocks. And then we get the scope as itself right here. Toss this on the ground. And here we go. This is the main part of this unboxing. It's, uh, it's packaged pretty nicely. I don't think it really got jostled around too much in the shipping, which is nice. And again, this does come with a Vixen style rail, so, you know, CG5, you know, Celestron mounts, uh, Orion Atlas, all that good stuff. Um, yeah, okay, and so what we could do is to get rid of, it has this paper film across the whole tube, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off the rings so I can Get that paper tube off. Paper lining, I mean, sorry. Okay.
And it's raining right now, so I don't even think I'm really going to worry too much about getting the right balance point on these rings for the scope. Just enough to tighten it down so it's not going to move. Um, yeah. That's pretty much what you get in the box. Uh, if you guys like the video, uh, maybe I'll do a review on it in a couple days when the weather gets a little better. But uh, yeah, this is the Explorer Scientific uh, 102 Acro. Alright, thanks.